guys remember all those old shows, those gold fever shows that we used to sit around and couldn't wait to watch on Sunday morning or Saturday morning whenever they came on? Or, and they're gone now, but you know what? You can still get the DVDs of all them. I got a whole saw, the sets of them all right here. All of them. I got all these, all the old gold fever CDs right here. I got them all right here. I know some of the old timers, you remember those shows. Uh, but anyways, it's all about the gold. It's all about getting out. It's all about having fun. And that's what I'm going to be doing today, getting some gold and having some fun. Let me show well, you what I'm going to do. Good morning, everyone. I'm up here on the famous gold mountain. And I'm going to be doing me a little bit of prospecting today. this wash right here and what I need to do look where people have been digging at in here look at that man they've moved a lot that's all over burden all right there they moved all of that out of the way and got down there to the bedrock look at all the dirt they left there see all this is all over burden it's all rocks that people just leave behind. But in these cracks and crevices is where I want to get to. So I need to find me a spot. See all this right here? This is all dirt. That's going to hold gold. Right there, and I'm going to get this out of here. That's what I'm going to do. I want to get all of that dirt right there. So I have me a vacuum. I'm going to vacuum that dirt up that's right I'm there. I'm going to come up here and I'm going to run it through this little backpackable mini monster. This is my gold fox right here. This little slick little unit. Slick little unit that is right there. Just perfect for what I'm going to do here. Bust up some bedrock, get me some dirt, and get me some gold. And then at the end, after I run this, I'll show you how that works. We'll pan it out. We'll see how much gold I get. You know, gold is on the rise. Uh, with the economy and the dollar crashing and banks failing, uh, you better start getting some gold. Collect that gold. Get the gold. Yeah, get that gold. You can see the sun hasn't even come up over the mountain yet. That's how early it is in the morning. There's lots of dry washing. Look at all them tailings. Lots of dry washing up through here. You know, they pulled a lot of gold. We're going to surmise the gold came from that hill right there. Because we metal detect found a lot of gold right there. And it rolled down and got into this wash. And this wash is full of gold all the way down to the bottom. There's another wash on the other side right here. But this wash doesn't seem to have as much gold. It does have gold, but not as much. Of course, I have found some big pieces over there too. But I just don't think it has as much. see one of these vacuums work these are kind of little slick little units here the uh just a leaf blower sits on a five gallon bucket and the uh suction from the bottom creates the vacuum and i'm just going to fill this five gallon bucket full of some of this material got these cactus thorns in here that i don't like flip them up out of my way Okay, let me bust up some of this bedrock here. Got me a slide hammer here. Perfect for this job. Oh, yeah. 
that should be enough to get me started anyways. <laughs> Woo -hoo -hoo. You see, that cleans that out pretty good. Nice and clean. Little slick the unit right here. Put that about 40%. I'm gonna have to level that off out there. But... Having this little wash bucket up here on top kind of slick. Let me wash them rocks off. Get all that gold off of it. Get all the gold off of it. I like it. <laughs> Ooh, look at that. That's some stickers. I kind of like this basket. It gives me a chance to really wash these rocks off good. Like I say, I really don't need it. But I like it. It's just an added feature. Like a little class fire. Saves me from having to classify all this stuff down. I could have did that too. Use probably a half inch classifier. Or put a screen over my nozzle. That would have helped too, I guess. Classified it down. But this okay. I'm just sitting here enjoying the day. Running some dirt. See if I get me some gold.
what's nice about having that rheostat on there, I can turn the flow of that way down. And I don't see any, I don't see any nuggets in there. Kind of a cool mat. Some aggressive riffles in there. And bend that there. Release all that material out of there. Turn up this a little bit more. Wash this all out nice and good. Okay, shut that off. Uh, now we'll pan this out. Before I forget, and there just slides right up in there. And this one here, it's only going to go one way, go right up in there, just like so. Okay, push it all down in place, ready to go again. Let me pan this out. Okay, let's see, I want to put this in the pan in this pan here, so. And I want to use this as a safety pan. Okay. All right, telltale sign, here we go. I saw gold. I already saw gold. It's a good sign if I see gold that fast. Okay, let's look at this. Oh, baby, let me show you this. Look at all that fine gold in there. Little fine, fine, fine gold. That's a nice little piece. Not bad, huh? Not bad for the little bit I just did. Not bad. Gold. Let me give you a close-up. Not bad. Not too bad. Well, that's not too bad gold for the little bit I ran. That's probably quarter of a bucket five gallon bucket maybe a little bit more of uh vacuum material that was right there and those cracks of that uh, bedrock right there deteriorated bedrock i'd call that there but hey that's not bad and i got me some gold you got me some gold well, that is a slick little unit uh slick little unit the gold box mini monster Back you know, if there was a stream up bed up in the mountains someplace, a little bit of runny water, you can just put that in your backpack and haul that up there, lightweight. Set that up by the creek and just sit there and get some material. That would be slick. But unfortunately, here in Arizona, we don't have that running water like that, so we have to haul water in. But hey, for what I did right there, lightweight, easy to pack in, doesn't take a lot of water to run it, and easy to clean up. And he's making a trommel for that thing. That is going to be slick when that comes out. A uh, little trommel for that little unit. Ooh, man, that's going to be fun. Anyways, hey, I got me some gold I got out in the mountains. Really almost before the sun comes up. It's not even 8 o'clock in the morning yet. And here I am, already got me some gold. This is a really nice uh, area right here. This is a private mining claim. Gold Fever Prospecting Club. We pulled a lot of gold off of that mountain right there. And right next to me is uh, private property. That's patented land right there. There's a lot of mines all over that hill right there on the backside of that hill. I'm sure they pulled a lot of gold out of there too. And down there was the old town of Winchester. The old town. Nothing left now but a few little foundations. That was about There's it. evidence all over. You walk around up here in the hills and all down in there. There's evidence of the old timers being up here. You'll see piles of their trash, their tin cans all over the place. 
you wonder what they hid, you know, as far as their gold and the gold coins and stuff or whatever they were paid with, the ones that worked the mines and those that worked out on their own with their little tents or little uh, huts or whatever they set up, little makeshift uh, cabins or whatever. But uh, there's evidence of them being all over these mountains up here. So never know what you might find. But anyways, I got me some gold, so I'm going to head back to the... Uh, home front right now but sure want to thank you guys coming along and sharing on these adventures please like share and subscribe i sure appreciate it but anyways till our paths cross again you guys all take care of yourself and someday i hope to see you all out in you the get out fields. there and get yourself some of that nice old shiny little bit of that yellow gold it's out there for the taking just go get it the mini monster backpack series gold fox <laughs> yeah like it